Any suggestions, Admiral? Prayer, Mr. Savick. The Klingons don't take prisoners. Star Trek The Wrath of Khan, that was one of the first instances of something basically being created as a result of pressure from fans over the years. Uh, the Wrath of Khan came out in the summer of 1982, which was a rather busy summer, if people will recall, for uh, extraterrestrial entertainments. E.T. came out that summer, uh, The Thing came out that summer, Blade Runner came out that summer, The Wrath of Khan came out the same summer. You're a Heidi. Hiding behind rules and regulations. Who am I hiding from? From yourself, Admiral. Yeah, I think it's one of the most beautiful instances of the use of matte and model special effects. And the other thing too about watching it in that sense is realizing that there were only a few years left of this kind of technology and also realizing that it was reaching a kind of perfection as a form of special effects before the digital technology came along and changed the way we thought about special effects. But I think one of the things about The Wrath of Khan that is amazing is as a visual experience and appreciating what those kinds of special effects, now not often used, were capable of doing. And it wasn't because they created a realistic world in the same way that I don't think CGI creates a realistic world. It creates a vivid one, and this idea of the man coming out of the darkness of space simply seeking a mission of revenge. For all of these reasons, I found The Wrath of Khan was compelling in a way that a lot of the other Star Trek movies just weren't. Khan, you still remember Admiral. I cannot help but be touched. I, of course, remember you. It had character. It had action, it had momentum. As I say, it's also interesting to remember just how busy the skies were that summer of 1982. I would not presume to debate you. That is wise. In any case, were I to invoke logic, logic clearly dictates that the needs of the many outweigh the needs of the few. Original cast, next generation, or reboot? Which Star Trek movie series is the best? Tell us below and subscribe for more from Hollywood Suite.